Hello, my name is Coleman Berry, and today I'm going to be talking to you about prompt 1-1A, which is Lynn's hypothesis for dosage compensation. In 1961, Mary Lynn, a geneticist, discovered a hypothesis that said X chromosomes were inactivated or turned off in females early on in the development stages. Once they have been inactivated, the X chromosomes are known as a bar body. For example, if you have three X chromosomes, XXX, this would not show any different phenotype. In other words, the females would not look any differently. Because bar bodies only affect the X chromosomes, it is known as an X link trait. So, what exactly does a bar body look like? A bar body looks like a condensed, dark, small circle on the end of a cell. The bar body is super tiny and condensed chromosomes that still exist in the cell, but they do not, the chromosome does not get used. A normal genetic female will have two X chromosomes but one of those would become a bar body. A normal genetic male will have one X and one Y chromosome, but will not have any bar bodies. Several years before Mary Lynn's hypothesis, Murray Barr discovered bar bodies in female tortoise shell cats, but did not know what purpose they served. The next spot, the dark spot in this photo shows the bar body that Lynn noticed when one X chromosome becomes deactivated. As you can see, the male, chromo the male cell does not have that. Tortoise shell cats are a good example to demonstrate the phenotype of something affected by bar bodies. Since the hair color is linked to the X chromosome and the deactivated chromosomes are chosen at random, we are not able to predetermine the hair color. For this case, the big B will be black hair and little b will be yellow hair. For example, a male cat with the genotype XBY will have black hair, and a male cat with the genotype XBY will have orange hair. So it is the opposite for the female cat, but in order for the female cat to have the tortoise shell color, their genotype must be XBXXB. If her tortoise shell cat is cloned, it will not look like its mother because each cat is different and only each cell produces one hair color. Traits on the X chromosome are inherited based off if it's a maternal or paternal trait. Therefore, random X chromosomes are inactivated. The cells would randomly inactivate as the X chromosome, resulting in either black or orange hair. Remember, the tortoise shell cat can only occur in females because two X chromosomes are required. 